Hello there guys, it's me, Wisely, and welcome to a new episode of Heretic God's Max Build together with my Exorcist. So this time, we have our dual pass build or pure Exorcist build but this time we have a different uh, uh, equipment. No, it's not a uh, Demars versus Unique. Yes, all of uh, those are unique but the different is the helm and the potion so this time we have our uh, default or our main choice uh, build which is a unique uh, unique build for our exorcist so to those who didn't know what uh, those stats his uh, that uh, character that does this character have so this character have strength 145 vitality 177 dexterity 23 and spirituality 177 817 defense hp or life 1696 75 percent fire resistance 21 percent ice resistance 24 percent lightning resistance and 75 percent poison recovery so on act on cast attack attributes, this character have 455 force per second that has 1.11 attacks per second. Attack rating 2678. Force per hit 409. Critical chance 5%. Critical damage 100%. Stun chance 0%. Knockback chance 16%. Miscellaneous attributes. This, this character have 5.24 walk speed, 61 life regeneration per second, hit recovery 0.6 second, reduce cooldown 50%, identify cooldown 60 seconds, uh, trader price reduction 0%, magic find 346%, gold find 60%, melee damage reflection 0%, range damage reflection 0%. Melee damage reduction 5%, range damage reduction 5%, melee defense reduction 0%, range defense reduction 0%, melee attack rating reduction 59%, and range attack rating reduction 59%. So, this character have, uh, so to those who didn't know what uh, his equipments are or why those stats, uh, uh, why this character have those stats that I've been mentioned. So we have our uh, Dictum Ignis Armet with a Rune World Fence, Grimmis Smile, Dios Libare, Kite Shield with a Rune World Disguise, Skimil, Quill Plate with a Rune World Turbo, Marot de Chatillon, Stave Bow with uh, 30, uh, 36 spirituality and 36 vitality drop nears and tasilo chalice so on our uh, skill to those who didn't know uh, what uh, his abilities or skills so this character have uh, dual uh, dual attack that uh, contains a malady main attack uh, main cast attack 24 over 24 and its booster epidemic 18 over 18 and secondary booster contamination 24 over 24 we have also secondary attack or alternate attack blade bottomy 24 over 24 and its booster transfusion 18 over 18 and last booster carries 24 over 24 we have also cadaverine 24 over 24 blessed palms 15 over 30 force shield 30 over 30 in its booster amber 15 over 18 another booster agate 17 over 18 scroll another booster 15 over 18 and last booster, Vengeance, 
15 over 24. We have also passives as well such as uh, glass cannon 24 over 24 and sangreal 18 over 18. So that's it. We have our um, exorcist uh, skill set A that has Armet with the rune word fence and Tacito Chalice. So now we'll move on to a secondary uh, equipment set or second uh, or uh, equipment or gear set B. And so here we go with our secondary gear set or gear set B for our pure uh, unique exorcist build. So this time we have our different uh, different skill build. So to those who didn't know what uh, this character have uh, those stats. So, so this character have strength 145. Vitality 168, Dexterity 24, and Spirituality 168. So, this character have 629 defense, uh, 1156 HP, 75% fire resistance, 5% ice resistance, 8% lightning resistance, and 75% poison recovery. So, on cast attack attributes, this character have 434 force per second. That has 1.11 attacks per second. Attack rating 2717. 391 force per hit. Critical chance 5%. Critical damage 100%. Stun chance 0%. And knockback chance 16%. So, in miscellaneous attributes, this character have 5.24 walk speed. 67 life regeneration per second. Hit, reco hit recovery 0.6 second. Reduce cooldown 50%. Identify cooldown 60 seconds. Trader price reduction 15%. Magic find 411%. Gold find 60%. Melee damage reflection 0%. Range damage reflection 0%. Melee damage reduction 5%. Range damage reduction 5%. Melee defense reduction 0%. Range damage defense reduction 0%. Melee attack rating reduction 35%. Range attack rating reduction 35%. So, uh, yeah, that's it. So we have our uh, um, so we have our gear set B. The helm. And potion has changed, so we but we still we still have uh, dictum ignis, creamy smile, just libare, kite shield with a rune word disguise, skimil, full plate with a rune word turbo, marot de chatillon, drop nears, and I didn't notice that uh, I have a different uh, save bow with a six. Uh, 72 I mean, uh, yeah 72 vitality so I mean uh, yeah 72 36 36 36 uh, yeah 72 <laughs> uh, so we have our stave bow with 72 to vitality and our helm which is plague mass that has a uh, uh, one hundred eighty percent poison recovery just to uh, fulfill the resistances, the poison resistance or poison recovery from Cinnamon's Reve Revenge, eighty percent poison recovery reduction. So, why I equip this uh, Cinnamon's Revenge? It's because of my skill of uh, additional. Uh, Two points on my lady. So we have our Plague Mass and Cinnamon's Revenge. So, what 
abilities does this does this character have so still we have our malady 24 over 24 and it's booster epidemic 18 over 18 and last booster contamination 24 over 24 alternate attack plebo plebotomy 24 over 24 and it's booster transfusion 18 over 18 another booster carries 24 over 24 we have also Cadaverine, still there. Pleasant Pant, 17 over 30. Force Shield, 30 over 30. And it's Booster Amber, 15 over 18. Another Booster Agate, 15 over 18. Squirrel, 15 over 18. And Vengeance, 17 over 24. So, that's it. And we also have passives as well, such as Glass Cannon. 24 over 24 and Sangreal 18 over 18 so that's it we have our gear set B for our pure unique exorcist build we complete the two types of unique uh, unique pure and unique exorcist build and so that's it for today's video thank you guys so much for watching Heretic Gods, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday, so make sure to subscribe. Ideas and suggestions, let me know in the comments. And we'll see you guys on the next video, and have a good day.